The other big story, a revised shelter-in-place order issued across most of the Bay Area will allow people to participate in more outdoor activities. The new health order impacts those living and working in six Bay Area counties, and those changes take effect May 4th through at least May 31st. KPI X5's Len Ramirez live in San Jose, where that announcement was certainly cheered today. Len? Definitely cheered by the people who uh, were on the job six weeks ago and walked off of construction sites like that one. Although this announcement was made here in Santa Clara County, it's part of a regional agreement with all of the health officers across the Bay Area. And so for some, it is back to work, but those that do go back, it won't be business as usual. We, if we were sort of dipping our toe in the water, um, easing a little bit. The lifting of stay-at-home orders for a few specific job types may be a small step for the greater Bay Area workforce, but it's a giant leap for tens of thousands of construction workers who can go back on the job starting on Monday. You bet we want to get back to work. We just have to do it in a way that's going to be safe for everyone. County officials stress that for the vast majority of Bay Area workers, the stay-at-home order is extended until at least the end of May. But for construction trades and other outdoor jobs like landscapers and even a few outdoor activities like golfing, the new order allows it with limitations. Outdoor businesses and activities likely pose lower risk of COVID-19, especially where there's strict social distancing. And so many categories of those businesses and activities will now be allowed uh, to resume. Bay Area health officers, construction companies, and labor unions have worked for weeks on new back-to-work protocols. Returning workers have to wear masks, socially distance, and work in shifts to avoid crowded job sites. This is the industry to choose to lead us out of what we're in. I mean, we, we know how to work safely on highways. We know how to work safely high up in buildings. We know how to work safely underwater. That's what we want, to the economy is going back, and we're going to be safe. Dr. Sarah Cody said this is only happening because the Bay Area has flattened the curve. And if we look at all of our indicators and see, you know, it's going okay, we can still protect the health of our residents, we can still make progress, then we might be able to ease it a little bit more. So it's a very um, gradual, stepwise process designed to be the most uh, protective of health uh, overall. Now, one of the main things that health officers are going to be doing is looking at those numbers. If there is a big uh, spike, uh, suddenly a lot of cases go up, then that uh, health order could be revised again and pulled back. Uh, by the same token, if the numbers stay flat or even go down, uh, then uh, there could be more of a gradual lifting. Reporting live in San Jose, Len Ramirez, KPIX 5.